Hello, everybody. Uh, Blonde is a movie with a lot of graphic nudity and mature themes, so I had to censor quite a bit of it, and there's still a chance that this video will get demonetized anyway, despite me doing that. But I figured I would try anyway, so here is the most censored version of this video. If you press the join button for a dollar, you can see the less censored version of the video, which definitely will not get monetized on YouTube. And the completely uncensored version is on Patreon, and it had to be there because it's just the, the version of it would just not be allowed on YouTube, even if I unlisted it, and even if it was just for members, it, like, it, it's not allowed on the platform, basically. Anyway, thank you so much, I appreciate your support, and enjoy the video, there is a lot more content coming very soon. Thank you. Andrew, Dominic, Blonde, we gotta start this right now, I gotta run immediately after this, so. Alright everybody, hope you're ready, because I'm gonna start it. Three, two, one. Alright, we're starting it. I don't think I've watched a single Monroe film, actually, which is weird. Because she's such a, like, ubiquitous, like, like a, such a common household name. I know, yeah, some like it hot is supposed to be good, I know that. I usually don't see movies for the actors, right? So when I'm going through all these older movies, I've never once thought, like, oh, I'll see a Monroe film. Oh, weird. What the fuck? It doesn't sound like fire crackling. <laughs> the subtitle said it, though. What the fuck? Was the subtitle just wrong? What is that sound? I'm gonna have to put you under arrest. Under arrest for driving my car? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love I love some of these car shots, the like really wide angle. I love that. Ugh, oh, that fire in the Wow. That looks like real fire. If that's CG fire, that's good CG fire. <laughs> What the fuck? She just loves fire. <laughs> help! Help us! Child actor, not great. There's something wrong with your mother? She needs help. It's a, like, I'm not personally attacking the child when I say that, like, I'm unconvinced by the realism of a scene that the child is in. You should still believe it's a character and not an actor. That's the goal, ostensibly. But I'm not an orphan. I have a mother, and I have a father. That's not how a like it's not how a child acts in terms of like script writing. Even you know that's part of it. Like there's no naturalism to it. Daddy. Uh oh. <laughs> I w there hasn't been enough about this character to make that input impactful yet. That feels just kind of like really unearned and weird. Yeah, it was like it's it is weird how it almost feels like it's supposed to be comedic, right? I can see why people took issue with the scene. It, like it feels like it was supposed to be like funny, <laughs> and I don't know if it was trying to be that way. It was just like handled really weirdly. The way that it was kind of just like nope. Eh. She won't bother you anymore. <laughs> She's doing such weird things with her performance, and it's weird because she's like acting as an actor, I guess. It is kind of weird casting, also. Can I try again? Yeah, I don't think that the actor should always just be like, who looks the most like them? Because you can always do like makeup prosthetic, you know? Sure, it's expensive, but. What do you think, boss? Sweet Jesus. Look at the ass on that little girl. This is so weird, this movie. <laughs> I mean, like, yeah, Ana de Armas is crying a lot, but I don't feel anything for her crying in any scene, which is kind of weird. Like, usually, if you're gonna, like, let the waterworks flow in a movie, you'd think that you'd want it to be, like, earned, you know, in the context of the film, but it's just kind of like, oh, she's crying a bunch, and I don't feel anything for her. And I don't think that showing, like, a traumatic event as a child counts as, like, developing her character fully. Like, I'm more interested in, like, what her character is as an adult, and we really haven't seen much of it, because we've seen her, like, crying and being and acting, and that's it. <laughs> like, even right now, it seems like her character is putting on a performance. Where's my daughter? No. <laughs> they said my daughter was coming. Uh -huh. <laughs> I don't know you. Who are you? I'm like so uncaring about the character. And cut. You get it? He said cut. That's funny. Cut. It's so phony. Cut. Do it. It's so phony and cheesy. Oh, what business of yours? <laughs> she sounds so Spanish. Did people in the 40s talk like this? What, Spanish? With Spanish accents? <laughs> <laughs> 
If they're from Spain, yes. I don't know if that's the implication for the character. I don't know if that's just a goof. <laughs> that font seems to like default editing software font. That's weird. You know what it smells of? Dreary old love paste. Is this Patrick Bateman? <laughs> I like to watch myself in the mirror. I like to watch myself on the toilet even. What? Uh oh, stinky. I don't understand what it's going for here. <laughs> this is the what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Dramatic heights when a man so what was that sex scene supposed to be was that like one person being shown metaphorically as two or were they like li are they literally two people they look very similar because one of them like disappeared for that mirror monologue right is it like i i'm like not even sure it's two different people this is feeling like a weird porn how oh, baby we found out and we still love you this is going to get nominated for some Razzies, for sure. Regardless of whether or not I consider it to be a good movie at the end, it's exactly the type of film that will get nominated for Razzies. But we're cursed, Eddie and me. Would I have turned the movie off by now if I wasn't doing a watch-along? No. It's very weird. <laughs> kind of have to see what the f <laughs> It's not, like, it's not one note. It's just, ve it's, like, so bizarre. This is, like, Art House the Hulk. <laughs> like Ang Lee's movie was like really fucking weird, you know? This is like leaning in that direction. That waterfall shot was so funny. Fatherless. This music's so weird. Killing them softly was good. I don't know why people hate that. I liked that a lot. That might be my favorite Andrew Dominic film, although I haven't seen Chopper or whatever this shit he made before. With the Gemini. He's a real Gemini man. Of Speaking us. of Ang Lee. Like twins. But there's three. <laughs> what? The acting's not good is the prop like no one knows what the fuck they're supposed to be doing. What? <laughs> the universe turned into <laughs> Uh This is great. Who said this wouldn't be good for a watch along? <laughs> Crazies. This is so ridiculous, it's hilarious. She could start f***ing the stuffed tiger right now and it wouldn't even feel weird for the movie. I'd be like, oh, okay, she's just coming again and they're, the movie's doing something weird for no reason. <laughs> like, it would just, it'd be, it would make just as much sense. I'm pooping. <laughs> I can't take the role. I'm sorry. Oh, because she's pregnant now. This baby shot is so funny. There's a lot of light coming into her womb. She cut a, she installed a window. <laughs> Rather, it's May 1953. I'm Norma Jean. I think the performance and writing are bad. I think that, well, yeah, like the actor can only do so much with, with what they're given. Uh, why why does it keep cutting back to the baby? It looks like plastic. Hi, Marilyn. I need help. I need help so badly. Are you going to get a blood abortion? This is so, like, just all over the place, and it seems like Andrew Dominic is just fucking around experimenting the entire movie without, like, any fucking clue what he wants to do. Like, eh, why don't we do this? This will put you in twilight sleep. This is funny. <laughs> Oops. Blabortion. Bye-bye, baby. Get a real graphic shot. There should be a shot of him sticking a gun up there. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, that would be so good. If it gets to the baby zone shot and you just see like a pistol enter the frame, <laughs> that would be so funny. <laughs> I don't care that it's a historical figure at all. That makes no difference on how I feel about this. It just feels weird. The whole thing is just kind of a mess. How'd you get your start? Oh, a penis. <laughs> it's so it's so silly what's tart could be a real penis maybe that's why it was nc-17 i mean it doesn't matter if it's real or not if it looks real i guess for the rating you often see frontal male nudity you don't often see like wet erect full frontal i want to settle down is anna de armas spanish or mexican 
Cuban? Your father? I understand that I have a special date after the party in my hotel suite. What if her dad was Charlie Chaplin? <laughs> that would be the best, actually. <laughs> we found your dad. <laughs> it's Charlie Chaplin. <gasps> Good thing I got abortion. For this, you killed your baby. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Baby killer, baby killer, baby killer, baby killer, baby killer, baby killer. I'm just a patsy. You're a baby killer. <laughs> I just want you to be happy. Now have sex, obviously. Yes, I guess. My coffee's wearing off. <laughs> I'm so screwed. <laughs> Sleepy. People make spaghetti. Whoa. <laughs> I mean, not just in a store. It doesn't grow on trees. I'm British. Many people are often puzzled by the fact that spaghetti is produced at such uniform length. But this is the result of many years of patient endeavor by plant breeders who've succeeded in producing the perfect spaghetti. It just goes on and on. <laughs> just goes on and on. How is... No one will stop it. Self-awareness is funny. Or lack thereof, I mean. <laughs> The heavy breathing is so funny. <laughs> There's no point to this shot. Who gives a shit? It's just like you're being weird for the sake of weird after a certain point. Hi, Daddy. Where'd you go to? Yay! <laughs> this film feels more like pornographic than short buzz. <laughs> Like, Short Bus is shot by people who, like, care about the characters in the film. This just feels like it's shot by somebody who's, like, ogling the actress. What's the point of this sequence? Why? What the fuck? This is so unearned. This sequence is so stupid. Isn't it delicious? It's the thing. Yeah. This movie makes me feel more comfortable not being super into the, the assassination of Jesse James. It makes me feel okay about it. There's the butt. More butts. See more butts. Whoa! This is, this is so stupid! This is so fucking obnoxious! I can't believe how awful this is. Just hit her more in a video game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> is he like it's in the left channel how flimsy is their house like he's not supposed to be right above he's like way over to the left and it's shaking the house it's so funny it's so shit it's literally like default fucking final cut pro font Octa wouldn't know how to read yeah the dialogue is bad there's nothing special about it you know the actors certainly aren't selling it Shot on an iPhone 7. Daddy, this is so beautiful. I don't ever want to leave. Stop calling everyone daddy. <laughs> Adrian Brody's hairline has seen better days. <laughs> Someone taking a photo? <laughs> Baby zone! Oh my god, it's so stupid! Can the baby start singing? Why did you kill me, mommy? Am I your good girl, daddy? This is so- this is like- yeah. This is Andrew Dominic's version of like, Knock Knock, where he's just making a porn. With Anna de Armas in it. <laughs> That's my daughter's, you take that off! You like how it fits me, daddy? Weird. Daddy. Darling. Well, this is this is like if I directed a movie and I got Jeremy Irons in it and I I like coded a bunch of like dialogue he should like say over and over just so I could add it to my collection, you know? Am I a good girl, daddy? <laughs> you are such a naughty boy. You won't hurt me this time, will you? Ah! <laughs> 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 oh, God, this is so funny. Why did you kill me, mommy? You're this baby. That was me. It's always me. You're not the same, idiot. 
I wasn't I wasn't like that wrong when I said it was like leaning in directions of like Ang Lee's the Hulk bad, you know? It's just, it's just so weird and stupid. Just a bunch of like random nonsense choices. I'm coming, Daddy. I'm coming, Daddy. <laughs> Darling, come down there with me. Huh? Will you? Hit her. They're waiting. Hit her. In a video game. Okay. <laughs> she tripped on sand. <laughs> well, my baby zone. No, not my baby zone. <laughs> Idiot. That's funny. That's hilarious. Save my baby. Please. Why did you kill me, mommy? Daddy! <laughs> oh, God. Daddy! This is the f stupidest fucking thing. Yeah, I mean, I could see some David Lynch fans liking this. <laughs> okay, just hold on. Okay, just hold on. I hope that was, like, euthanasia. I hope that was... I hope that's gonna put her to sleep forever. <laughs> in a video game. She is naked, like, so much in this movie. <laughs> in, like... Yeah, like, what the fuck? In, in scenes where it just, like, doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Are you trying to destroy yourself, Norma? That doing? audio editing, holy shit. Fuck you! And fuck this movie! Yeah, fuck this movie. I don't to go up. That's a weird... The glow on that light. What the fuck was that? <laughs> this is so funny. This is a crazy movie. Who are you? Oh, crazy. Why did it... I'm your husband. Marilyn Monroe will not be coming in today to impersonate and demean herself. <laughs> You will have to shoot around her. Whoa, well, no, her baby. She's mad, sad about it. I, more. It's just the same sound effect over and over, too. It's like the telephone ringing, guys. The baby is like a ringing in her head. I like the name Whitey, by the way. Why doesn't she just have another one if it's all the same baby? <laughs> have another one. Maybe don't fucking one shot it next time. Her reflection's moving, but her self isn't. That's crazy. Why right channel? Why right channel now? What? That has to be a mistake, right? This is Andrew Dominic's Nymphomaniac. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Oh my god! Yeah! <laughs> it's face man. This is like the craziest movie. Oh my god. Yeah, this is trying to be Lynchian and it's just failing miserably. Well, oh, David Lynch. Nobody's perfect. <laughs> well, you're not watching this on your fucking phone. And the sound just cuts. This font! <coughs> Yummy. It's funny how I dimmed the lights for this movie. I was like, I might enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> if that's how big airplanes were, fucking let me go back. Am I meat to be delivered? Is that what this is, room service? Am I meat again? Happy birthday, Mr. President. Is he in a diaper? <laughs> He's diaped up. I'm not glad to see you, baby. This has been one hell of a day. This is so stupid. <laughs> this is like a POV shot. Literally POV shot. <sighs> oh, baby. <sighs> Andrew Dominic's a, a turd. <laughs> He's kind of a turd. <laughs> I'm not a child. You don't have to worry about me. I'm just a baby. The deep voices. The soundtrack's in the right channel right now. Why? My baby zone. Who cares? Who cares? Oh my god. Who is it? It's your baby. 
Why, why did you fall on me, mother? Was I not pretty enough for you? <laughs> why is it so veiny? Is this, like, is it infrared? Slenderman? <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> this is so silly. It's a good thing Ana de Armas consulted with Marilyn Monroe's ghost when filming each scene. All right, do the do the pistol. Do the pistol in the baby's own shot, please. You have time to make this right. It's just a dream. It's just a dream. Oh my god. Baby's own. We yeah, like this is like the second the second vagina POV shot, right? This is so stupid. It's Eddie G. Cass is dead. It feels like video game voice acting. <laughs> like like late 90s video game voice acting. Brad Pitt is a producer. This is his production company. Plan B. That's so funny, actually. Thanks for reminding me. He's done every one of like Andrew Dummick's films, I think. I don't know if he did his first, but... That is a funny name for a production company for the Baborshin movie, you're right. This is the most, like, hilariously incompetent and, like, com comically misguided film, like, of the year. I don't know if I've seen... Like, it's just so not self-aware. So pretentious and stupid. I'm like, yeah, I'm completely not emotionally invested in anything that happened the entire movie. <laughs> I don't even know what she read. I'm like, I don't even care. I'm like, not even, I didn't even read it. I just, I looked at the words and I didn't register any of them. What did the words say? Oh, that's very stupid. Is she going to babort herself? <laughs> <laughs> I'm naked again. <laughs> I only am naked by myself. I only wear clothes to go outside. <laughs> she had a dog? <laughs> the f- Mama Jean, look. What the fuck? That man is your father. Oh, I'm a ghost now! <laughs> ah, Neil Breen ending! <laughs> Woo! Oh my god! Oh my god. Neil Breen ending. This is crazy! I'm sh- Oh, this is embarrassing. <laughs> this is embarrassing. This is not critically acclaimed, no. This is very- This is a very polarizing movie somehow. This film was very confused. Yeah, they did several POV vaginal shots. Okay, thanks, Andrew. Thanks! This was like a- f like on <laughs> Brad Pitt. This was honestly like a two out of ten movie. This is crazy. I I had no idea when I watched Smile two nights ago that this would be worse. <laughs> like this is fucked up. Jesus. <laughs> this is like what this is a horrendous movie. <laughs> this is like actually <laughs> like very embarrassing. <laughs> Wow. This is this is like Showgirls where it's just a horrendous movie but then some people think it's a masterpiece. <laughs> yeah, this is like crazy. That was nonsense. I'm going to change my pants. Cuz I shit myself. All right, I got to go. I got to run to the film festival taking place in Vancouver. So I got to go. That was legitimately horrendous. 2 out of 10. Shit movie. Awful, 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 bad, embarrassing. Bye, everybody.